Okay, I'm sorry, I cut this off. But my son and I have been working on this chicken run, and I took the ducky door off right here. This is the ducky door, and I'm making the door jam a little smaller to hit the ducky door. Mine's, my son says, hey, this is kind of warped, and I said, a little bit, you know, got wet. Duckies, you know, are wet kind of creatures. And we just got done putting this extra piece in here. And he says, are you sure you know what we're doing? Yes, just zip, we're gonna zip tie it in. And uh, he said, that's not gonna last, but it's just a roof just to keep them, keep the water down. And I, I gotta zip tie this all down. See, it's zip tied here and it's zip tied here. And he said, well, don't you wanna screw it down? Not necessarily, it doesn't need to be. Only the sides need to be screwed down. So he screwed that down. This is not even screwed down. I put these things up here. I need to work on getting some clear plastic to put down here. But I told him, this here I'll add, like I did here. See, I add one here, see it there? And I'll add one underneath here and go down. And that same thing over there. Then over here, oops, oh, I hate this thing. I gotta get rid of it. And I wanna cut this here off about this far and then put in one that's gonna follow this down through there. Same thing, this will follow down through there. And I'll do that later. So he and I have been working on this. The chickens are gonna come out. They're so excited, I can't wait. But I got that wall all done. I just need to wire it. I'm still working on wiring it and everything. Can't believe how well that looks. I got one board placed in and that's screwed in right there. I still have to put in security on the ground to keep the dogs from digging them out. This is all secure here, but I need to put another piece of wood across here and down here, which I have not done yet. And then I need to put a post or some kind of thing here following this all the way down to put a wall in. So I'm gonna put a wall in and, but the wall is gonna be like, I'm gonna come in here and put it in and then the wall will be really close and tight knit all the way across and then this can come off and then it'll be clear plastic up here. Same thing going all the way down there. And then over here, I went ahead and put the wooden wall up. And everybody's like, how are you gonna do that? Well, I'm gonna take this ha um, half inch stuff and I'm gonna put it on the outside all the way down. And then I'm gonna take the one fourth, like I did at the bottom here, and I'm gonna follow that through all the way there, and then down here, do the same thing. And then I'm gonna block this all in. And you can hear them in there talking. They're like, are she gonna let us out? No, not yet. I know, I need to. They're in there, hello, look at them. They got so big, those Jersey Giants, and definitely think it's a boy now, because he's getting a really beautiful tail. He hasn't crowed yet. And there's the female right there. They're so much huger than my other ones. And uh, they're talking to me a lot. So I'm going to put this back here just to keep them, you know, more secure. And I put a couple of plastic things down there trying to keep them as warm as possible. It's hard to do. And then I put this tarp over here to keep the blow down that blows in there since there's nothing right there. How'd you get out of the house? I swore I just got done putting you in the house. Did I leave? forgot to shut the door? Did I forget to shut the door? Gosh, that means Mona's out. No, door's closed. She must have wanted to come out. <laughs> anyway, so I was going to fix this door jam here and fill in this and then put in uh, a half inch here, half inch there, half inch there. Went and got some more half inch. Got a little bit left over here. My son said, are you going to be able to put one more slice across there? Probably. I probably will put some here that will go here. I'll get up on here. I'm on the hill. So I cut that down to fill it in. And see, that thing is bowing. I gotta, I don't know if I can get it unbowed. My son says, you know, this whole thing's bowing. I know it wasn't like that before that wind did it. Oh, so I don't know if I can unscrew this and pull, pull this back, but I might have to unscrew it and see if I can pull this back, but I'll do it later. I'm not worried about it right now. I'm just trying to get it built. So this thing is kind of bowy, but we're working on it. And there's my baby. Hi, baby. So this is going to be a big enough run to house those two to come out and play. And then the grass is all dying off. Leaves keep coming in. I keep raking them out. And I'm going to put, like, I've got bracers on the bottom. i got bracers on the bottom down there. And, uh, but I'm going to have to try to push this out somehow. I hope. I hope I can. I mean, because I had one of these on it, and I should have left it on there to cup it straight. But I need to take it off to put the, put the wire across. But we'll see how it goes. And I still got to do something over here. And uh, when I the first, I'm going to build the first wall here, and I got to get this all wired in. See how this is all open right there? See, and it's open. So I got to get all that wired in. I keep hitting my head because it's really low here. My son says you should build this as tall as I am. Well, yeah, but you're not going to come in here, are you? 
to took care of the chickens are you i mean if you are it's going to be right here i'll probably put water out here eventually so they can come out and get water right now the water is in there with a light over it to keep it warm and i did cut a little piece there to get rid of that little v because you know not all the wood is straight so and i still got to place a piece of wood down in that little crack and get that fixed up or maybe when i put this in it'll it'll work i don't know so my son says this is crooked i know we'll get this this whole wall this crate needs to be pushed out i know i'll push it out later i'm not doing it right now right now it's just the way it is until i get it until i can get this mostly built and i'll probably unscrew that and push on as hard as i can and then put the screw back in and that should hold it up nice and straight and we'll see so there's going to be um like this wiring on the outside and it's going to go all the way down well mostly all the way down and all the way up to here so it'll go all the way up and now i have to put in a, a placement board like like I don't know if it's on this side or it's going to be on this side. It's going to run the length of that so that can be stapled on. Which I haven't got that far yet. <laughs> Gotta watch my head. I want to hit it a couple times. I've done that. So I've been working on this door jam here. Building it up so this door will fit. And then i got to put some wiring in here. Or maybe just put more wood here. And then make it into an actual wall kind of thing. So that's what I've been doing. Working on this thing for the, the chickens. I don't have ducks anymore. So now this is the big chicken area. And then eventually, <laughs> i get this all done, I'm going to come out here from this section and going, I thought about bowing it around there to about, not all the way out there, but just enough to go around here to this door and then have a little fence here that I can come in and let the chickens roam out here with all the leaves, which I have to clean this all up and at least get the sticks and stuff. My husband keeps dropping sticks off here, so throw them back that way. Stop sticking them here, now it's going to make me up more work for me to take up. i got to get some of this briar stuff move back a little bit and just kind of like make a place for them to come out hopefully they can't fly away but i don't know i haven't got that far I even thought about making it come all the way up to here and have the gate coming here so i can come in and then go in here and then let them out from this one here i haven't got that far but it's starting to come together i don't know where my dog went to i have the coach and leg bar mixture over here uh, they don't get along with nobody in the garden so i put them out here for now I was thinking about, you know, there's, I'm thinking about like that little girl there. She's sitting on the roost. I don't know if you guys see her or not. She's so colorful. She looks just like everybody else. And then the orange one I'm thinking about keeping and then taking Rocky and Penny and selling them to this guy. Where did, where did Penny go? Where did Penny go? I don't see Penny anywhere. Penny, you didn't get out, did you? I don't see Penny. Hey, Penny. I don't see Penny. You guys didn't eat her, did you? Here, I'll just open this up and find Penny. Maybe she'll come running. I don't know where she's at. Unless she's looking at the... No. I don't know where Penny's at. I don't think I let her out by mistake. Oh, great. Let's see if she's in there. There she is. She's seeing colors of dirt. There they are. There they are. It's not the one up there. Let's keep those two. And then the next generation that's coming from my girlfriend's house. And try to tame them. So I tamed these ones. They're all tame now. They're pretty much you can pick them up or whatever. And lock this door. <laughs> I don't want anything to get to them. I got the door lock system on here. That's actually Bella's door lock and Bella's little thing here. And then this is here to kind of help keep the warmth in. And there's my dog. I don't know how she got out. I don't think she came out with me. See, I have this wiring here that I thought of using around them to let them out a little bit, but I don't know. That's why they got in the chicken tractor so I can move them around. And I put the well. Here the well's up in here. It goes this way. But now, since I got this thing over here, I can put that on the whale. Because I have the one out there that I taped up real good. But I bought a green one. I don't know where it's at. But I told my husband, you have a yellow one or orange one. What would you do with it? Oh, no. So this is the one right here. If I can get this on there. It goes on here. I put a bottle on it for now. That's not very good because something still can get wet and everything. If I can just get this thing open. Uh, easier for said than done. Arr, there we go. And then this here, open that up, see like that. And then you take this crazy bottle thing off. Oh no, I can't get it off. Well, I can get it off later. Stay up there. And then this goes in here like this. See how that goes in there? I can get it on there. Like that. And then my knee here. This down here. And this squeezes on here if I can get it down hard enough and then squeeze it on <clears throat> nope come on oh man it usually squeezes on pretty easy 
There you go. It's on. And I just have to cut this off. I'll do it later. But it, that is on there. That'll keep it from the rain going in and messing up the cord. And it goes in there. And I got a thing that's going to go in there that I can hook up another thing for them. But I haven't done it yet. Is there light on? Yeah, it's still on. Looks like there's somebody out here talking to them or something. Should have put something like that on there. Oh, well. Hey, at least they look hands and happy in there. And everything. Anyway, um, my plants all died. It's cold. It's back in the the teens i gotta rake this section out see how i put in the wiring and then i put a tarp over there to kind of help with the cold oh i hear daddy out there he must be raking leaves anyway so i got all this to clean up and my son and i've been working on it got this all done in here i did here i'll show you i put a because a one board over here i put cardboard in that kind of gives it a insulation effect and i put the cardboard in to kind of help with the uh the cracks and i haven't filled the cracks in so i thought well i didn't get a chance to get back to it so i'm just going to do this for now and come back later and maybe do the cracks on the outside and smooth it out and we'll worry about that then and uh but um this is all pretty much keeping its own and it's keeping the cold out and then my husband says you know it's not super warm in here i didn't turn the heat on the heat if the heater's on number two this place warms up real nice because it's like a five by five room and that, that, that heater will actually keep it warm in here. So, but I haven't got it started. I didn't do any of that. I just, anyway, I'm going to let you guys go. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.